Alright, I've looked through the many comments on my last video telling me what I should spend this money on, and now you may notice I have more honey than last video. And why is that? I actually did a boost in between last and this video, it was only like a 900 billion boost uh, on Stumpfield over here, and it was a pretty decent boost, and also, I spent my gingerbread on the loaded dice bundle, I've used 5 of them, ignore that, I, t I had to use 4 to actually get stump field which was very sad but i've actually bought the glitching bundle now for the 25 load of dice we'll be using these sparingly because they're really expensive and i will not be wasting them i also did some macroing here here and there and we got up to 3.5 trillion honey now i want to preface this at the start of the video because a lot of people every video ask me hey macro 24 7 and i can okay i can't even macro overnight okay so Give me a break, if I could macro 24-7, I could earn tens of trillions every week. I could earn, I could earn at least 10, like, 10 trillion in, like, a couple days. Because I get, like, 1 trillion per macro, per, like, 10 hours of macroing. In fact, like, per 7 hours of macroing, I can get 1 trillion. So, I could easily get to, like, 10 trillion, 20 trillion, like, 100 trillion within, a, like, a couple weeks. It's not that hard, it's just I can't macro every day. I wish I could, though. I just macro every now and again in the daytime when I can. Anyway, now I've got that cleared up, let's go buy what you're here for. The hive slot over here, costing 2.16 trillion honey. Yes, expensive, very expensive. Okay, it is time to buy it. I am sorry, my honey, my honey is gone. There we go, we still got 1.3 trillion, which I'll spend in another video. I'm not going to spend that this video. Well, I might spend a little bit, because we got to get something in the slot. And I've got some royal jelly to spare. I do have, uh, like, about uh 100 billions worth yeah i've got 69 nice 69,000 royal jelly here please subscribe by the way because this video is very expensive on my honey and i only make a certain amount of honey per like day or whatever so let's put required mythic on what we want here is actually a buoyant b i believe and then i'll have a better ratio 19 to 10 i'll have apparently i'm meant to get a slightly um a slightly different ratio i'm meant to get like 20 to 8 uh however we'll just take a buoyant for now please uh I, I would keep it. Maybe, oh, I'm, I can't keep it. Let's go. Hundred, whoa, after 156, you're... Phew, Jesus, the luck there is insane. Really? Really? I know I'm a blue hive, and, like, I should be happy about getting tab... Uh, that... Okay, I was just... I just clicked that there while mid-talking, so I could be disappointed at not getting... Because I was only on, like, 5k Royal Jelly. Oh, wow. Um, My luck here is actually insane. 30k, that's above odds. 156... That's definitely below odds, and 33k is also four blue, uh, three blue bees in four rolls. Insane luck, that one. <laughs> anyway, we've got an extra buoyant bee. Apparently, I should actually get one more, but we're not going to do that right now. Uh, so, let's see if we can level up this thing. I think I can probably level up quite high. Let's just feed all our treats to it. There we go. And what level does it get to? Level 15, like that, and it's halfway as well. Jeez, that was easy. <laughs> well, that was a lot easier than I thought. That was I did it in the Royal Jelly. I didn't have to spend a single piece of honey apart from this hive slot i had spent a lot of honey on that but i don't have to spend any extra honey and next video i don't know what i'm gonna do but i'm probably gonna be spending the rest of this hope you enjoyed and i'll see you guys in the next one goodbye